Oh, that looks delicious. And it looks like somebody is stepping up their pizza game. So. But first, please hit that, uh, if you haven't done sorry, please hit the big subscribe button down below. And uh, let's uh, ring that notification bell. And don't forget to smash that. Also smash that thumbs up. All right. <laughs> and welcome to the channel. And uh, let's get started. Oh, welcome to March, by the way. Now let's get started. see the hashtag here and as always you know what to do so first and foremost i apologize here if the audio is like out of sync or anything like that but you know i had to strip out the original audio here as uh, i wanted to originally upload it here but then youtube blocked it on copyright so thank you to the copyright owners all right, now this is what we gotta do to monetize our videos. But you know what? Let's begin another video. Hey, welcome to another awesome episode of Hashtag Mukbang Monday. And so, those who see it here, you know what? We're back at Fazoli's. As hey, they got some brand new items here. So, as I'm uh, holding up one of them here. I can see here, I'm holding up one of the new flatbread uh, pizzas. This one is the Parmesan garlic chicken one. As you can see here, it's got the flatbread base with some Parmesan garlic sauce and covered with melted mozzarella and provolone cheeses with some oven roasted chicken. Got some uh, bits of crispy bacon on there and a little Parmesan uh, cheese. Uh, garnish on top of it cut into slices and I of course I ordered this as a meal so we will get started uh, very soon here I've got the side salad and some iced tea to drink and of course uh, you know some delicious unlimited uh, fresh baked breadsticks so now we'll start with the salad here this salad, you've seen it before on my uh, on my other videos. We've got the leafy greens, the cherry tomatoes, the uh, the red radishes, and the the onions on here, and also the uh, shredded uh, cheddar cheeses. I, of course, right now putting on the uh, the croutons. And then we're putting on the house salad dressing. And while you're doing that, I guess y'all are, uh, you know, acknowledging my t-shirt here. So if y'all are fans of Married with Children, you know what this is. So, now, let's go ahead, as I put the salad dressing on... And uh, now let's dig in. You know, just gotta get everything right. And let's see here. Oh, by the way, this is my first time doing a voiceover for my uh, vlogs anyway. So, take a bite of that salad, and ooh, yeah. It's, uh, it's definitely fresh. It's crunchy. You know. And, you know, it's very satisfying. Uh, so Vizzoli's does make some awesome side salads. 
As a matter of fact, it's the best side item if you ever get a meal there. And, you know, I mean, you, trust me, you guys will love it. And who knows? Someday, I might try one of their entree salads. And, you know, so all in all, I like to give the salad. My score for the salad as a review part, this is a 10 out of 10 unlimited freshly baked breadsticks. And I can tell you this salad is delicious. Couldn't say it better myself. All right. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> so satisfying. And. Oh. Yeah, definitely love the you know, so crisp, so fresh, and a bit on the healthy side too. But overall, it's perfect complement to a meal. It's a great appetizer, by the way. So. <laughs> Let's see here. Oh. And while we're doing this, I also... Oh, the other day, I did get some donations here. That some people want some shout-outs, so... Uh, let's see here. If I can name them off the list here. As requested, they don't want the amount specified. But hey, you know, thank, uh, thank the following people for their donations. So a special thanks goes to... Natty and Natalia's Wacky World. Uh, Papa Capone, OG Papa Capone, High Five Toes, New BH, Van Owsley at Scoundrel Studios, uh, Jack Pickrob Vlogs, Pickrob 2000, Jack 1888. All of them, guys, thank you so much for your donations. All right, and now I guess we're going to get on with the pizza here. So let's, uh, let's finish the salad first. You know, we're still digging in because we all know it's so good, so good. And we want to clean our plates. So keep digging in. Right? And. Uh, now, let's, let's put a breadstick down. Because, you know, where if as always, you know, we got to have breadsticks. And that breadstick, at the time of recording, fresh, baked out of the oven, spongy, doughy, garlicky, buttery goodness. Yeah, no trip to Fazoli's or pretty much any Italian restaurant is complete without breadsticks. And uh, for those who don't like to eat breadsticks, hey, you know, there's there's plenty of other uses for them. All right. 10 out of 10 for the breadsticks. But I guess we got a couple more bites of salad to go. You know, clean your plate. On to the next meal. On to the next part of the meal. And then now we got the flatbread pizza. 
This one again is a garlic parmesan chicken uh, with a flatbread base and that's covered in the parma parmesan garlic sauce and the melt some mozzarella and provolone cheeses plus also some pieces of freshly oven roasted chicken got some crispy bacon pieces on there and then after they bake it, garnish it with the Parmesan cheese seasoning. And now let's go ahead and take the first slice. Mm, yummy. Definitely, I gotta say, now I'm not a huge fan of Zoli's regular pizzas. Because they're, they usually come out all greasy and, and they're just rather plain and there's not much to offer. But these flatbread pizzas, they are definitely, like, quite a few steps above. And, you know, proves that they could be really creative. As a matter of fact, this is so delicious. I mean, I'm, you know, me being part Italian, so I definitely love Italian cuisine. Definitely love the pizza. And I would say that this part right here is the best part of all. And the part, like the Parmesan, garlicky, chicken, goodness, especially with the bacon, it's a very authentic flavor. So all together. I give this also a perfect 10. Fazoli's is definitely making it perfect on this. So, now, this is a limited time offer. And I think, you know, if, if anybody from Fazoli's is watching this, I think right now, this needs to be a permanent menu item. And speaking of that here, this is actually part of the line of the flatbread pizzas. They, uh, for those who want another variety, there's a plain cheese one. There's also one with just pepperoni. And there's the sausage and mushroom one. And all made very similar. Those actually start with the pizza sauce and then they have the same cheeses and have the uh, said toppings. Now, my only suggestion, one more suggestion for Fazoli's uh, would be, you know, to maybe offer some more toppings and maybe offer a uh, create your own option. And I'll also, speaking of another pizza like thing, Fazoli's, if you're watching this, uh, please do, well, first off, keep flatbread uh, pizzas available permanently. And please also... You know, satisfy us fans here. Bring back the pizza baked pastas. Those are amazing as well. They're, I mean, your restaurants generally have the ingredients to make them. So as long as they're selling, how about make them permanent menu items as well? And also, please, uh, Fazoli's, I, you know, I'm one of your fans here that also saw your advertising for stuffed garlic shells downside i won't won't be able to review them because you don't have them here in colorado springs for zolis hear me out please make it happen because i definitely want to try those things so i can share them with my viewers share my thoughts on it with the viewers so i definitely want to try the stuffed garlic shells now back again on the pizza this thing I can say, here's another reason why the flatbread pizzas need to stay on the menu. It could definitely turn the pizza industry on its head. Uh, you can't get this anywhere else that I can think of right now. I mean, let's say, not Domino's, not Little Caesars, not Pizza Hut, not Papa John's. Oh. <laughs> And not even those like fast casual pizza places. So I think this would be an outstanding option.
Mm -hmm. And so we're going to watch the uh, rest of this in silence from here on out. Because again here, I had to do something to strip out the audio entirely so that we can, you know, monetize this uh, video. And also, this way you guys, uh, you watching this, can see it. So, you know, just uh, this is what we have to make do with here. So as we are, you know, as we're going to wrap things up pretty soon anyway. So again, thank you to those who have donated to my channel. And also, thank you everyone here. I know for watching this as well here. And I hope you guys are enjoying this. And hey, if you have fizzlies nearby, run to them. Tell them Robbie P2 sent you. And try these flatbed these flatbread pizzas. And let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. And also, hey, if you're brand new to my channel, please hit the big subscribe button down below and ring that notification bell so you don't miss out on any notifications. And then also, you know, and then also join all the other loyal supporters who I call hashtag Robbie P2 family. And hit, and not only, you know, smash that thumbs up so we can slay the YouTube algorithms, but please also leave a positive comment down below and let me know what you think about this here. And then also, hey, after you do all this, run to your Fazoli's and give this a try. I highly recommend it. But now, let's come back to Earth here first. Because also, guys, uh, for those of you... Who would like to request, uh, I don't know, something that you'd like to see me review on the channel? Feel free to hit that big uh, description drop down arrow so you can reach out to me on email, Instagram, or X, or my Twitter. All the info is there. And also, there'll be a link to the Robbie P2 fan shop so you can get yourself some official Robbie P2 merch, like the hat I'm wearing in this video that says hashtag Robbie P2 family. You know, it's all for sale there. And you can also request a personal shout out for me on Cameo. Price start about $20. All right. Glad y'all enjoyed this uh, new take on uh, hashtag Mukbang Monday or whatever I got to do uh, to uh, avoid copyright or something like that. You know, so this way, avoid the background music. In fact, this might be a new style for me. All right. That's about it. And as always, stay happy, stay safe, stay positive, your boy, Robbie P2.